Hi everyone and welcome. My name is Starscream1988, or better known to my, all my friends as Odie. I'm giving you here my first toy review ever. Um, I've been collecting toys for a very, very long time and um, been seeing a lot of reviews here on, on YouTube and getting a lot of inspirations from a lot of great people out there. So I just kind of want to throw my take on it, my opinion. Um, and so with further ado, here we have today Hasbro's Marvel Studios Captain America, The First Avenger. Now, this figure here actually, I believe, was due out on the 16th this Monday. But for whatever reason, they've they've actually been thrown on the aisles and the shelves. So, um, what further ado, let me turn them around. Uh, this is the back. Um, gives you a little bio. Uh, what other figures are in the line. Okay. <clears throat> Now, this is a deluxe mission pack, and um, a few months ago on toy, when Toy Fair came around and they were talking about these, you know, I saw these and I was just like, eh, I don't like getting anything that is um, gimmicky, uh, but um, it, it's actually pretty cool. Um, you know, it being a Hasbro brand, it seems to have a lot of inspirations, inspirations to like like the G.I. Joe line, obviously, you know, they they, they, they mastered the three, three quarter inch scale, um, but this is really cool. This is the... The number two in this comic series, the the mission pack with the um, parachute, as you can see, um, it's really nice detail. It's not Chris Evans likeness, not yet. It's still based on the comic series, and it does say it right here. It is the comic series, um, but nevertheless, it's a real cool figure. Um, and I'm an opener. I don't I don't leave anything in in its case. So I did want, obviously, for you folks out there that have not seen this yet, I wanted to show you what the package would look like. But um yeah let's let's um let's open them up. Cool. Now as you can see out of the package, um these you know basic uh, Marvel U size, three quarter inch. Um or some people are saying they're actually four inches now. Um they, they seem to be a slight a little bit taller. But um very, very cool figure. Um a couple of things that I've already noticed off the bat. Obviously I opened it and I checked them out before I um you know talked about it um the shield is a little smaller than the regular marvel u one thing that's very cool and i was always really annoyed with the marvel ones and i'll show you that in a second is that they always would have a, a clip in the middle and like this really huge elastic for such a tiny figure um let me kind of actually bring that out um that would be for example that one right there and as you can see from the inside uh, let's see if he can hold it and obviously he can't it's really difficult. Um, it's it, it, the shield is a little bit smaller, but again, they always came with that real stupid looking thing there, and such a big hunk of <laughs> I don't know even what to call it. I guess strap. It's just huge. Um, another thing to notice in comparison is um, you know obviously they're almost the same size, but this new one here he seems to be a little bit bulkier. Um, I don't know if, if, if it's actually better proportion. He looks more human. This guy, he is really lean, tall. I like him. I, I think he's awesome. And I know he's based more on the um, Ultimate Captain America. But um, he's really, you know, tall, lean. While this one here is just um, just kind of beefy all around. Um, I was going to try to attempt to take out the harness, but it seems to be a pain in the, in the you-know-what. So I decided not to because obviously I'm going to display him. But a um, couple cool things that they added on these new articulation is, um, you know, obviously they all do this, but that seems to be new. Um, I haven't seen that in a, Mar in a Marvel U figure yet. So if anybody has, please let me know in comments or whatever. But that's really cool. Um, you know, and that's only if you want to do some some crazy pose. Um, but, it, you know, it has your, your typical knee bent. It has your elbow you know the ball joint there the head moves all the way around um, so it's you know it has everything that a normal Marvel you would have um, on the accessories let me move this guy out of the way here he does come with this gun here um, I don't know if I'll ever pose him with it because to me Cap is just not a guy that you know would ever carry a gun I know he has in the movie and doesn't the ultimate you but uh, it's kind of like a Batman character, you know, Batman just doesn't carry guns, doesn't believe in them. And I don't think Captain America really does either. I, know, I mean, I know times change, but 
Um, but yeah. And then the coolest thing, I mean, honestly, for the for the eight bucks, this is this this is amazing. Um, let me just move the camera here. Um, this thing is really really cool. I, I think I'm probably gonna get a second one just so I can have another parachute. I mean, that's him in the middle, and that's his parachute. Very 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 cool. Um, and I'm gonna show you next with him with him on it. So here he is. With his parachute strapped to him, and as you can see, it's it's a really good size. Um, I would say that is probably eight inches in diameter. Um, you know, the figure being three, so it's a good size, good length. Um, so anyway, I could actually put him up there. Um, of course, you know, I won't be able to ever display him like that unless I, you know, find a, a, a way to put him up or something. But. Um, it's pretty cool, a lot of cool details. If you look here, they actually strap to the uh, to the parachute. So it just hooks off like that. And that's that, and that's how he would loosen himself up. Boom. So again, pretty cool figure. Um I would recommend them. I think um, they did a really good job. I mean, Hasbro always does a real good job with their properties, but um, yeah, this came out pretty cool. So, sign it off. Um, please send me comments. Subscribe. I'm gonna be doing a lot of these videos on the same week here. So, um, hope you enjoyed it, and hope it was a, a first preview for you. Thanks again. Bye.